In other news, a man is shot at one of the busiest intersections in North Philadelphia. Let's check in with Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore. She's live at the scene at Broad in Germantown. Good morning, Crystal. Good morning. Well, the victim was rushed to Temple University Hospital in a U-Haul truck, currently in extremely critical condition now. Part of this block here looking like a battle zone. Just look at the free library of Philadelphia here. There's a bullet hole right in the front glass. Part of that glass shattered. Now, we don't believe anyone was in the library at the time of the shooting, but right next door, the Chinese takeout restaurant apparently had a couple of workers in there when bullets went flying into the front glass. Now, Here's what we know about what actually happened. Around 1.30 this morning, police were called out to Broad in Germantown for reports of a shooting. When they got here, they did not find the victim, but they did find a lot of bullet fragments and bullet holes in businesses and at least one car. We are also told that detectives found several bullet casings from a semi-automatic weapon a block away near Airdrie and Park. They believe that may have been where the shooter shot from and hit the victim here on Broad Street. Police say the 24-year-old man was critically injured. He was shot once in each arm and in the chest and back and is currently in surgery. It was not until police got to the scene that they learned the man was rushed to Temple University Hospital in a U-Haul truck. The victim was driven to the hospital by a U-Haul vehicle. And the driver of that U-Haul vehicle, as well as the U-Haul vehicle itself, are being held. It's part of the crime scene. Now, we're not sure if the victim knew the driver of the U-Haul or he was just acting as a good Samaritan. But detectives are talking to the driver of that U-Haul and we're holding the U-Haul van as part of the scene. Now, police are still on scene. We're told they're looking for three suspects. At least one of them went south on near Pacific Street. Now, surveillance video is also playing a critical role in this investigation. Anyone with information is urged to contact the authorities. We're live in the Tioga section of North Philadelphia. Crystal Cranmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Crystal.